Y'all don't mind my Brinks ate my lip gloss. I'm been binge eating cookies and ice cream and y'all. So the fact that it looks like this is crazy. If I let you smoke it, you gon' lose my light huh? If you pay with nothing, I'ma spend the night yeah. Can't get out of the movie, damn it Time I dance with you, it's my money I was telling y'all the same thing too and it, it still has not gone away like I still be in this little like damn I really miss her it's it's sad it's so sad like when somebody consumes your life it's so sad this is like birthday number birthday number four without her so it's like and I need to stop saying it's like it is it's just it's so sad when like you have somebody that's so close to you go away and then you have like other things that are still continuing to happen that you just want to be done with it but it's all right though it's haitian flag day yeah i i have nothing to update y'all out that's why i really pull out the camera because i've just been roaming and running the streets with my cousin acting like i'm 20. acting like i'm 20 honey so I picked up some new um, makeup technique and I bought some new stuff. Y'all, I done spent $500 on makeup. Makeup, makeup brushes. I'm just, but then again, I'm thinking to myself, when I get my makeup done, it's like 200. So I'm not really, I didn't really spend a lot cause I get to continue to do my makeup the way that I want to. But I'm like, I'm trying to pick up some new techniques because you remember I told y'all I, I get very sweaty and oily like very fast. So I got the one size. Um, this one is ooh, Sweat and Secure. So I got this one. I got Sweat and, oh, Sweat the Secure. Secure the Sweat, y'all. <laughs> so I got Secure the Sweat. It says Dry Till Dawn Primer. So um, squeeze the dime size drop onto fingertip warm it up press it into your skin before makeup pro tip secure the sweat and wait one minute so i what i did was i put it on i used the bobby brown moisturizer so i used this and i used the the hydro grip i used that i use all three because i'm like i don't want to put milk of magnesia on my face my friend told me to use milk of magnesia but i'm like i don't want to use that because I have very sensitive skin. Like the littlest thing that touched my skin turns my skin haywire. So I'm trying to be careful with what I'm using. And then I realize when I do my contour, like if I do a three, like right here, instead of up top and dragging it down, I get more of a slimmer face. 
than how I used to do it before. So I drag it down from the top now and bring it down like this. So I've been trying to dibble and dabble. Work's been great. Um, What else? The Kendrick Lamar beef. It's so much stuff that was going on in the internet. It's just like crazy. Kendrick Lamar and Drake beefing. Kendrick Lamar won. Let me tell y'all something. Y'all cannot go against a Gemini. Our mouth is nasty. Our mouth is nasty. The way we think and view things is because we're a very observant person. Like we won't say nothing, but when the time comes for us to say it, you're gonna be so shocked with, with the stuff that we're holding in. You're gonna be like, damn. So all this time, this person was really looking at what the I was doing. And it's like, yeah. <laughs> Hell you thought this was, like, come on now. So we're going to a little Haitian flag thing. I was supposed to go to the one for Friday. Um, Friday was here and y'all know I love Friday. He sings that song, I won't waste your time. I won't waste your time when it comes to you. But baby, I fell asleep. How are you? Because I was tired. I had a lot of like little ripping and running to do. So, but tonight is Vibe Beijing. I think Oswald and something else. It's Haitian. So, you know, to my um, non Haitian followers, um, we'll be outside with the crew. And I bought new brushes. So, I bought this because it had like a taper into it. I felt like it's more, it'll be a little bit better for contouring. Yeah, I'm trying to know how to beat my face. I know how to beat my face. I just don't know how to control my sweat. But I realized it's certain steps that I was missing when I was doing my face. So that's what we're doing now. I'm gonna let this dry a little bit. And that's another thing. I don't let my products dry. I'd be such in a rush because, of course, I'm very bad with time management. You know me? So when my friends be calling me and they be like, let's go, and I'm like, okay, I hop in the shower, hop out this, and just start beating my face. So I don't let the product dry. I have a fan, but of course, Cameron took my fan, was using my fan, he broke it. So I have to buy another fan from Amazon. So then after that, I'm just gonna be um, planning my birthday trip. The trip is already planned, it's already booked. I already got outfits. Um, I got outfits, just gotta pack now and just, the birthday hair is already, we already know how the birthday hair is gonna look. Yeah, I can't believe it's my birthday already. Like it just turned 2024. 2024 is running. And it's running and it's dragging bitches at the same time. Like it's literally dragging people as it's running by. Yep. Uh -huh. It's dragging people, it's showing people who they really are. I'm flabbergasted and so upset about how this man was treating Cassie. Like that's why I always tell people like sometimes Having a luxury lifestyle is not luxury sometimes. You don't know what the person is going through. I was a victim of domestic violence um, when I was in my 20s. And when I tell you, these people are such, I know people be like, well, why didn't she leave? Why didn't she? They're very charming people. They're very, like they know, it's like a jackal and hide thing. Like they know how to be sweet and caring and loving and charismatic. And when people are around them, everybody just loves them because everybody's like, oh my gosh, they're so, they're so fantastic. They love to give, they love to share. But deep down inside, when the doors close, they're a maniac, a maniac. And the way that he like body slammed her to the ground and kicked her and was throwing faces at her and doing all of this and I'm like, bruh, it, some certain, certain, um, certain social media pages wasn't giving a warning, trigger warning sign. 
and some of them did but by the time they were putting the trigger warning on it i already peeped it and i was like it gave me flashbacks i was like damn this is like and it's you'll always find your knight in shining armor at the end of the day but you know some women they don't get to that part because a lot of times they end up dying like these men end up really killing them they end up doing one wrong move and they give them a brain injury or they shoot them or they stab them like it's one or the other and i know so many people are like dang she could have left like does she know who she is like when it's somebody who has so much power like that somebody who's like kid cuddy was saying like when he kind of thought he was trying to get with Cassie he even tried to like damage his car like he was doing the most so somebody like that with all that money all that power like you're terrified because imagine if you just go into your car and then it just your brakes don't work like I think that's what she was afraid of and I think by the time she met his trainer one thing about trainers that one hour session one hour session doesn't seem long, but it is long. Like hour or 45 minute session, it's long. Slowly but surely you start to talk to the person and you become one with the person to the way, like the person is asking like, how's your day? Like, how's the kids? How's this? How's that? And you're like, oh, they're doing this, they're doing that. Cause you're lifting weights and you're talking at the same time, trying to get the person mind away from the counts. That's what they're basically doing. And I think, God places every somebody in your life for a reason. And her husband was there for a reason. And I think her husband probably witnessed some things too, which really got him to be like, yeah, you don't need this. So, yeah. So let me finish because it's been 10 minutes. I don't want to ramble on on this vlog we're gonna go um pour our tea i'm gonna show you the outfit my outfit's gonna be by Adi simone i was gonna wear it for my birthday trip but i think it's cute for tonight because it's red i'm like i want to wear red tonight because of haitian flag day so we're gonna do that and then i'll show y'all my outfit i have to be more more in depth with y'all i scheme the surface like sometimes when I'm uploading the videos and editing it, I'm like, damn, why didn't I show that? I could have showed that. Like, I just be in the zone sometimes. I need to really be more vigilant with my vlogging. And that's what I'm gonna do. So, we're gonna see y'all in a couple of minutes. For y'all, it's gonna be two seconds. For me, it's gonna be a little minute. <laughs> so this is the phase. Y'all think it's 18. So I finally, y'all remember I told y'all I've been trying to find this lip combo, this nude lip combo. And I think I finally found it. Y'all don't mind my Brinks ate my lip gloss, but it's still, it's just the outer that's like, it's still, it's still good. So this one is Fortune Cookie by NYX. And then I have Juve, Juvia, Juvia, Mademoiselle, and then NYX, um, you know, I always use MAC lip liner, but baby, this NYX, or is it NYX or NYX? We gonna say NYX. NYX, um, Espresso? Honey, honey. I wanted to do red lip, since my outfit is red, but I was like, let me do nude with red on top. Cause I, this is like burgundy, it's not red. So I kind of like how it looked with this. So I was like, ooh, with the red, yes. And then I fixed my hair. Cause baby, my hair was giving Hurricane Katrina earlier. Um, and lately y'all, I've been buying pack of hair. So this is Sensual the Gold Package. And you remember back in the day, we used to wear this? This was like bundles to us. If you were born in the 80s, this is bundles to us, baby. Back in the day, in the 90s, and the early 2000s, baby, sensual, 
Oh, you were that girl if you were wearing sensual in your hair, honey. You're that girl. Everybody loved this cup on me. So, yeah. All right, let's get dressed. I'm taking my time because my cousin is, she's A, not home, and B, we gonna see, um, cause I don't wanna do too much since I bought two of these. I'm trying to figure out, ooh, did y'all see my butt? Cause I definitely don't have no pants on. <laughs> Uh, y'all probably were like, girl, we wouldn't even know if you didn't even tell us. Um, I have bought the travel size of this, so I got the bigger size this time. Uh, I'm going to use this when I go to, to my birthday trip. And of course, I had to get my topical fade cream. Baby, this fade cream, huh? It'll have people stop you and say that your face looks so pretty. So instead of using... um. Instead of using my Laura Mercier, I used a one size. So what I'm gonna do is I need to build my, I don't go on trips like how I used to, but I'm gonna start going back on trips again. Um, build a, a trip bag for my makeup so I don't always gotta keep packing makeup. So stuff like this, since I bought two, I'ma just keep it. I use a new concealer, which is Hourglass, and it's called Beach. Let me see if it, I don't think it's gonna focus. But it's called Beach. And baby, I like it. It's, mm hmm uh-huh. And then I got a tip where somebody said to use the matte, the Soft Matte Powder Foundation Pro Filter by Fenty. Chef Kiss. Rihanna, you did that, boo. Miss Riri. Why, 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 you see me doing? And then I bought new, my new um deodorant. Y'all know I bought this to use it and baby, I fell in love. So this one is done. Baby, let me tell you what happened one, to me one time. I threw the new one away thinking that I threw the old one away. Baby, I was butt hurt. But this is the business. I love this deodorant. Like. Y'all should get it. I tried the I tried the new Shea Moisturizer deodorant because they have a deodorant line on. Garbage. Did not like it. It actually made, and I'm not a sweater. It it made me, it made my armpits sweat. And I was like, what is this? This never happened to me before. So I don't know if y'all like it. I thought I would have liked it because it had the niacinamide in it. And that is supposed to make your underarms like, it gives it like a natural color. Cause sometimes with shaving and stuff, it causes it to be a little discolored. So, um, I thought that would have worked with the discoloration, but it didn't. Yeah, I'm just putting a little bit more translucent powder. Cause baby, I'm trying not to sweat. Not to sweat, but not to get oily i get oily so bad but last time i did my makeup and i went out i went dancing i and it was not oily and i actually did it way before the 12 hour mark so that's so i'm like okay i think i'm getting better with the products that i'm buying for my face to not be so oily so and then I'm just gonna keep the little pro filter on my in my bag so I could touch up my face if it do get a little oily. And I press it into my face too. So that's another trick that I've I've kind of found. I found this girl on YouTube. I'm gonna link her her um tutorial. It got like over a million. We're we're not the same skin tone color. She's like She's way darker than me, like way darker than me. Like what she uses to do her highlight is what I use for my foundation. That's how light she is compared to me. So, um, but I kind of just took her, her, her tricks and I just colored customized it to myself. And so far it's been working. And so far I've been loving my face, so. 
We gonna see, we gonna see, we gonna see, see, see. I don't know why my, um, oh, probably because I just shaved and I didn't exfoliate. Okay, y'all, let's put the clothes on. So the outfit is by Audie Simone. She hands make this. The only problem was my underwear. It's very see-through, so I had to wear underwear. I tried to find something that like matched my skin tone, so it really wasn't like that apparent. But the back part, like my thong is not a low cut, like how the back is like a low cut. So yeah. And then I'm gonna wear red bottoms with them. I was thinking about wearing my Tom Fords with them, but my Tom Fords be hurting. Uh, it be the pinky dog. It be tearing my little pinky up. That's what I'm trying to fit. You know what? I'm just gonna bring both shoes just in case um, and see which one fits. The, the, the Tom Ford, I can't stand up on it for too long. The red bottoms, I could stand up because my cousin talking about she she didn't get the section yet. So y'all know what that means. This is gonna be standing for a little minute. Y'all really don't want, I really don't know what to do. I think the red bottoms look cuter anyway. So I'm just gonna wear the red bottoms. I just put my red Chanel on so I could just walk around for a little bit. But yeah, let's, ooh, the body body. Y'all, I haven't worked out in a month and a half. The fact that my stomach, it's still flat is flabbergasting to me because baby <laughs> mama been binge eating cookies and ice cream and y'all so the fact that it looks like this is crazy to me but anywho let's go If I had to tell y'all what we had to do, we had to literally pretend that I was Felicia Ross, y'all. So I could, <laughs> Felicia Ross is a Haitian artist, so we could get into this. It's so bad. <laughs> When I tell you pay, pay. Oh, you can't bring your camera.
yesterday by Clarissa. Aren't these so pretty? Look at the thumb. Y'all, Clarissa. Uh-huh, uh-huh. The birthday nails. So, um, we're gonna go to Leslie to get my hair done. And then I have to pack. I think I have a little bit of Haitian Flag Day in this vlog. And then, um, from Haitian Flag Day, I think it skips to present time now, which is May 30th. Because Mama Pooh wasn't really, I was doing things, but like I was saying, I was smoking hookah and drinking. Like, who wants to see that? It's getting boring. But I kind of cut back on the hookah, baby. That hookah had me in a chokehold. I, and I had to realize there's a reason why I stopped smoking the hookah and I need to keep it up, so. I was doing a little too much and a little too much drinking too. My stomach started like to poke out. So I'm like, mm, my birthday coming up. So I stopped drinking two weeks ago. Like I really, I was like, yeah. My cousin was like, are you on antibiotics? No trick. I'm on not trying to get my stomach big because alcohol has 9% empty calories, 9%. That's why when you be seeing them dudes that look eight months pregnant, baby, that's that's beer belly. That's straight beer belly. So yeah, let's go to Leslie, y'all. I'm I'm hungry, but I don't even know what I want. And lately I've been eating um first watch, their little Belgian waffle. Oh my gosh, that they had me in a chokehold for a good little minute. I think that's what I should have did. But it's okay though. Cause I get, you know, let me tell y'all a little secret. I get the kids one. <laughs> Cause the waffle is so big, I can't eat the whole waffle. And I hate leftover waffle. Like when you warm it up, it be all mushy. Like, mm -mm. I have a texture problem in my mouth. Like anything mushy, like, or like, mm -mm. it just, I don't want it no more. So I know I could eat half. I get the kids. Belgium waffle with two slices of bacon and some grits. Y'all gotta have their grits. They grits, if you Haitian, you love their grits because it's like my mule. When I tell you, oh, that thing, it's not the white grits, it's the yellow grits, baby. I think it be good. <laughs> Slap your mama good. <laughs> and then I get their little drink, like the purple haze. Y'all tell me if y'all ever have first watch before. And if you have it, you need to go. Y'all need to go. But let me not get on my soapbox and talk about nothing. And get this birthday maintenance done up. I'm going to do my own eyebrows because lately that's what I've been doing. And I've been loving the outcome of it. Since I'm the... Anybody who's born in the 80s, we went through the tweezing very thin... Well, not tweezing, but um, razoring our, our eyebrows really thin. We, I went from razor to threading to waxing. And I guess my hair follicle was like, yeah, baby, we done. Like, uh, we not coming back. So now I want them to be thick. And they don't, they can't be thick. Like, they somewhat thick. But I want, like, all this bottom piece to grow in. And, baby, it's not growing in. So I gave up. See, it's so crazy because back in the day, I used to be so hairy and I used to hate it. I used to shave like everything down, like even my widow peak. I would take this off too. 
and now I want it back and the bitch is like it's not coming back like make up your mind do you want me or do you not want me like now you want me now I can't come back <laughs> but yeah my this is the tip of the piece of sweating on my No kicking off the covers or blasting the air. Oh my god, y'all forgot to show y'all my hair. Y'all was so sleepy. The sleepiness was real. But this is how the hair looks. She taught me how to curl it. All this time I was curling my hair the wrong way. Hopefully I can recurl it on Saturday so it could look just like this. Even though I know um, Texas um, weather is just like Florida weather. So 10 out of 10 is gonna drop, you know? But I love the hair. The moment I walked out, a guy was like, you model, what's good, what's up, yeah. The moment I walked out. Yeah, I don't know why I have y'all so high like this, but my cousin, it's her birthday too, but her birthday's May, May 25th. Um, my cousin calling me. So I'm just packing her her gift, which, cause we always on the phone gossiping. And she wears, she wears like the, the headsets that come with the AirPods. But it always like crashing and giving her problems. So I was like, you know what? Let me give her some real cute ones. And I keep on hearing her saying like, I need to get AirPods. I need to get AirPods. So I'm like, okay. Let me just give her some AirPods. For her birthday. She's a Gemini like me. Baby, let me tell you something. I didn't know so many people didn't like us Geminis until... It became Gemini season. Like the comments, hilarious. It's like a 50-50. It's either some people love us to death and some people just want us to die. Like, I'm like, what did we do to y'all? But you know, the problem with, um, with Gemini's is we, we keep it too real. Like we're very observant people. We won't speak out right then and there because we feel like mm, there's no real justification to speak out. But baby, when the time comes, when the time comes, you going to wish that you ain't never said nothing. Because baby, when we tell you we're going to guilt in on you, y'all saw how Kendrick Lamar went in on, on Drake and Drake ain't had nothing to say. It took Drake a little moment to come back. Um, But when we do come for y'all, we be tearing it up because we're very observant people. So we just watch. Be like, okay, another tally. Oh, you want to do that? Okay. Another tally. Oh, okay. You want to do that too? Another one. Baby, until it's time to gather the tallies up and show you your receipt and show you why you ain't an it shit person. <laughs> That's how we roll. So yeah, I'm still packing y'all. I just got to finish packing. Put up these clothes that I got from Zara. I got these shorts. They're so cute. But the only problem is, of course, my waist. When I tell you they fit, fit so cute on the butt. So I'm a 10 in Zara. These are regular Bermuda shorts. I was going to wear them with a white t-shirt and some orange heel and my orange Hermes bag. So that was going to be the plan. But they're so cute. But the waist is so big on me. Like, I have to get it taken in. But I didn't have time to. Um, I wish I did now, but it's okay. I could wear it somewhere around here in Florida. You know, it's summer. The kids is off of school. So, it's time to do some local things with the children. Let me call my cousin back and see what she wants. So, I'll be right back, y'all. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,